Hello YTPC, this is Double Pipe here. Good afternoon to you all. Just started raining. It's Ireland, what can you do? Uh, this morning I was smoking my recently uh, refurbished 2003 sterling silver P-lip, unfiltered, rusticated, fantastic pipe. I'm right down to the end of the bowl of trying uh, Samuel Goud Best Brown Flake. Uh, it's brilliant. It's fucking lovely. It's really, really lovely. It's lovely on the retro help. It's not. It's not huge on nicotine. It's not a big nick hit hit like Condor. It's a taste. There's a there's a uh, a bread that is sold here, a fruit bread that is sold here in Ireland called a Maltana, and it tastes like that. It tastes like the crust of the Maltana. If you stick the 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 it comes sliced. If you stick that in a toaster. Give it a little bit of a, a toasting, put butter on it, it's fucking delicious. And this tastes like the crust. That's how nice that is. <laughs> no wonder people are raving about it. It's really, really good. Uh, what would I advise? Learn how to pack a pack flake because um, I've lit this thing 47 times. I've used three lighters, four pairs. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's you learn how to pack it well because it's annoying when you don't. They're always fucking lighter. Um, what else? It's delicious. If you can get your if you get a chance to get some, get some. I'm a bit envious of people who live in the UK, Europe, Scandinavia, uh, Asia, Russia, uh, Australia, South Pole, the North Pole, the Moon, because it's easier to get tobacco on the Moon than it is to get it in Ireland, other than Petersons. Now they brought out new lines now, but it's still 25 quid a, a, a tin. I might buy one every maybe month or so to try. Um, but still 25 quid a tin is a bit, you know. Don't mind spending money, but I'm not one for giving it away. I can't put my finger on it. It's a, it's, it's a bit like St. Bruno. Hold on, hold on, hold on. It's a bit like St. Bruno, but it's St. Bruno's better looking sister. Is the way I can say it. It's lovely. It's more than lovely. It's really shocking gorgeous. <laughs> Another saying here in Ireland. It's fucking lovely. I'm going to hook up with somebody next year to send me over some from England. Um, because it is that good. I knew it would be because everybody's... Every review of it says it's fucking great. So And it is. It's really, really good. I'm enjoying it with my tea this morning. Or this afternoon, I should say. Barry's tea. Low fat milk, you have to look after your figure, and one sugar. <sighs> Pipe is great. It's great. When I got it when I got in initially I was going happy days. And uh, the tenant was a bit difficult. Um it would only go in about three mils and it would not go in anymore so i had a look and it just wouldn't go in so i had to sand it down a little bit with some uh, 800 grit uh, or 1000 grit sandpaper and then i used some soap some unscented soap 
which I got the tip from Briar Blues. He said if it's too stiff, if it's too tight, uh, put some soap on it, unscented soap. And if it's too loose, put some beeswax. Makes sense to me, and it works. It works a treat. Down to the end. I have one ball left, and uh, I'm gonna put that away for. Um, I'm gonna put that away. Really nice. Have to say, I like these peelips. I really do. Yeah. Drew, I can't thank you enough. Uh, I really can't. Because uh, I never would have a chance to, you know, to try this. So, uh, thank you to all my subscribers. Uh, thank you to all everyone who comments, and all the lookers, the people who look and don't comment. They're it's lovely to to to, uh, to know that you're out there as well. To be honest, it really is. Um, and uh, big shout out to my sister who watches this every now and again. Hello, sis. I love you. <laughs> And it sees on the next one, Slav from Dublin, Ireland. 